Hello and Happy New Year. We're in the third week of January and my name is Montine. I'm your spiritual life coach from Engaging Breakthroughs. And today I'm bringing you three places to clear to make room for 2023. In the first place, I'm going to invite you to make room for something new and beautiful is in your technology, whether it's on your computer or on your iPhone. Uh, the biggest challenge for me was to delete some apps for some games that uh, were no longer serving me. So that's kind of a big one. But you can start with deleting old photos, old files, um, of course, any applications that you're no longer using, delete any emails. Uh, I'm guilty. I kind of keep a lot of clutter there. So in your technology, go ahead and make some space and you can just do it five minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, and that'll start to shift the energy. The second place I'm going to invite you to start clearing is in your wardrobe, in your clothes. And it can be just something really simple as going through your sock drawer and uh, clearing out those old worn out socks, maybe that have holes in them. So let's get a nice fresh pair of socks on the feet to uh, support us walking forward into 2023. And if you want to take that a step further and pull out some gently worn items, t-shirts, jackets, pants, whatever, that you no longer love or you're no longer using, I'm going to encourage you to donate that for someone who would appreciate having those things. And then the third place, it's a little bit uh, more of a challenge maybe, is in the mind, in our mental body, in our emotional body. So the way that you would do that is to make an appointment with yourself, set some sacred space, and just review 2022 and the things that you no longer wish to take into this new year of 2023 that you'd like to, I'd like to invite you to externalize them, write them out, write them down. And it might be something that um, might be carrying shame or guilt or blame, or any stories that you're telling yourself that's not growing you and nourishing you and helping you along to create the 2023. So take some time, 15 minutes, make an appointment with yourself, write it down, get it out, bless it, burn it up, put it in a God can, but just let it go to make room for you wherever you are on your journey. If you haven't blueprinted for 2023, now is the time. And if you have, let's start making room for what you want to come in and grow so you can have the best year ever. I'm believing in you and you've got this.